Kaya, a fantastically strong female role in this film for yeah. you, Emmanuel, and the Truth About Fishes. And also, first time for your American accent. What was it like playing both those things? It was really cool. I mean, I love strong female roles. I could never see myself playing just the girlfriend or, you know, just the love conquest or anything like that. I, I, I like meaty roles. I like intelligent roles for women. And this, like, spoke volumes to me as soon as I read it. Um, as far as the American accent goes, it was great for me to, like, push myself because I'd never done it before. I had an amazing voice coach who taught me loads about it technically and, you know, all the ins and outs of it. And it, it was a great skill to pick up. And hopefully it wasn't too bad. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Are you working with Jessica? Um, Beale and also with Alfred Molina in this film what was that like great acting incredible I mean with Alfred I had to kind of really try and keep concentration in the scene because I wanted to just watch him he's got this amazing power as an actor where you, you just want to watch him and you just completely believe everything that's going on and I, I you know I, I totally wanted him to be my dad by the end of it I was like please <laughs> just adopt me and he's genuinely one of the nicest men in the world it's so kind he's still got that British humor he's very sarcastic and funny and he just kept everyone smiling all day and the same with Jessie like she's, she's an incredible role model to me now you know she really mothered me and looked after me and made sure I felt safe and comfortable all the time um, it, it was a great experience to work with them. Now, of course, in this film you play a kind of confused teen, don't you? And you spent a lot of your time on camera playing teens in Skins, of course, and that is coming back, isn't it, for Series 7. Yes. Tell us what you're looking forward to about returning to what, something I guess you maybe thought you would never return to. Yeah, I never ever thought I would return to at all. Um, and I didn't really want to until I found out that they really wanted to focus this mini film um, on that kind of age you go through where you're not a teenager anymore but you're not quite an adult and you don't you're trying to work out what it means to become an adult and I was totally going through that in real life so it felt important for me to go back to Skins because it had been such an important part of my life and a part of me growing up to then experience that again with them and tell that story because I couldn't really think of any other mainstream program that had done that. I think a lot of people want to focus on university and then your sort of late 20s and stuff but that really kind of early time where you, you're kind of lost, you know, completely overwhelmed and you've moved to a new city and all these things. And um, I wanted to go back and work with Lily Loveless again. I really wanted to work with Charles Martin, the director, again. So for me, I, I really, I can't wait to, for everyone to see it. And in a way, it's going from that, that um, teenhood to adulthood, isn't yeah. it? And you've kind of done that in a way on camera yourself haven't you so what are you taking from your own life experience back into skins now I think we all take something it's such an important time and it's totally like yeah I, I don't know the, the, the storyline that Evie goes down is completely different to what I've gone down obviously but I think it's still there the friendships you know things that you thought were majorly important when you were 14 suddenly aren't anymore and you kind of want to focus on work and, and different things so I, I kind of took that aspect into it so what can we look forward to with the new series of skins Oh, there's a lot. There's a lot going on. Um, she starts working in the city and makes her way up, and she's living with Naomi, so it's all about the balance of their friendship. Oh, I finally want to ask you, you've got a huge potential franchise on your hands as well with the Maze Runner. How exciting is it to be involved in that? I'm so excited. It's a dream come true, and it's a really, really cool trilogy. Um, there's no kind of lovey-dovey romancy stuff. It's very much hardcore. It's about survival. Um, it's about people finding out what's going on and conspiracies, and, it, and it's very intelligent, and I'm absolutely honoured to be a part of it. I cannot wait to start filming. Will Poulter and Thomas Brody Sangster? Yeah, yeah. Really good British cast there as well. All playing American. In Louisiana? <laughs> yeah, in Louisiana for 10 weeks. I fly out in like a couple of days, so I'm really excited. We look forward to seeing that, of course. Brilliant um, look with Emmanuel and The Truth About Fishes. It's a fantastic film. And for Skins as well, so much to look forward to from you. <laughs> Thank you very much.